So the Nancy M. Cummings Research Extension Education Center was gifted to the university by the Allen Foundation uh, in late 2000, uh, early 2001. And so when the university first got the research station, it was a, had been a cash hay operation with about 30 cows. Cows from the commercial Charlet herd from Moscow were brought down in addition to the herd that was already here. And also there were over a hundred heifers that were donated by the ranchers of Idaho, which was part of the agreement with the Allens uh, to prove that they were interested in having a research station. The research that we do here is, is predominantly beef cow-calf research as well as forage research related to feed production for cattle. The major areas have been nutrition in terms of feed efficiency and um, heifer development and also a lot in the areas of reproduction. We also have been doing some work with the Simmental Association uh, demonstrating the value of crossbred bulls. And then on the forage side, we've done a lot of work with trying to increase the length of the grazing season and reduce winter feed costs. You need to try new things in agriculture. And in an experiment station, you can try things that may impact profitability and a, a rancher may not have that luxury. They have to make a living. And so we can try some things that uh, might be quite innovative but yet might have a, a degree of risk in it, like on the crop side, trying new varieties, trying new methods of irrigation. On the livestock side, um, kind of pushing these cattle in uh, a little bit and challenging them and seeing what kind of response we get. We compile that data, we present it to our scientific colleagues in professional meetings and in journal articles, but we also uh, present it to the clientele, the ranchers in Idaho through schools, uh, presentations that we do, and through extension bulletins. The beef industry in the state of Idaho is the second highest income producing agricultural enterprise, second to dairy. And so the work that we do here to help improve production and sustainability as well as profitability has an important impact on the state. And of course, those kind of impacts from agriculture have multiplier effects in the communities throughout. One of the interesting things about the beef industry in the state of Idaho, which is different than some of the other agricultural commodities, is that beef is represented in every single county. So it has an impact throughout the state and not just a specific region. I think one of the things that we'd like people to understand about what we do here is first and foremost, we're open to everybody, any day to come visit and see what we're doing. And we're very proud to talk about what, what we're about in research and how uh, the beef industry is involved in supporting, feeding the, the human population, especially as we're growing towards nine billion people here shortly. So we are always open to having discussions on why having beef cattle is, is an important way to feed people. In addition, we're <clears throat> very sensitive to how we do things, how we manage the animals and the land resource from a sustainable aspect. 